Hello all. Thought I'd make a video on a program I've been using for a number of years now called Clean Mem. It's from PC WinTech. Uh, they have lots of great utilities uh, that are free to download and use. Uh, Clean Mem is uh, can, is free. Uh, there is a pro version, but it only includes a couple of extra things um, in the uh, with the mini monitor, as uh, it's called. However, I purchased the pro license just to support. Uh, the development of this uh, program. Um, basically, what it is, it's not a, it's not going to be a magic uh, pill for your system. It's uh, it uses the uh, standby memory in Windows, uh, which is cached uh, memory, and instead of uh, calling to the page file as much, it'll try to use that instead. And you can also set it up to uh, Keep Firefox, for example, as memory in check. So down here at the bottom, there's a little uh, uh, monitor. And you can see how much is being used, memory, total, and uh, total commit. And you can see it's going up and down in percentage. And you can set your own rules for that. So this is Windows 8. And I have tons of uh, memory, over, um, 12 gigabytes. It's not as much as it used to be, but it's still quite a bit. So if you go to the uh, task manager and you open resource monitor, you see the standby. Just give it a second. There you go. And if you hover over standby, uh, memory that contains cache data code and is not actively in use, and then cached is both uh, modified and standby. So it's using uh, this standby, which is great. This is what we want. And that's what he explains in the uh, about uh, section here. So what I've done is uh, I paused the, uh, I've actually exited uh, clean mem and I'm using Firefox uh, UX version uh, just for trying out. You can see the memory is going up. Uh, to close to 200 megs, which is nothing really, but just as a proof of concept. So I'll turn the uh, service back on. Uh, all right, so it's been uh, reactivated, and uh, it's supposed to uh, clean every minute or so, or you can manually uh, manually clean the memory. So, so clear memory now. And Firefox has dropped way down. Okay, and there's a rule. I don't know if it'll work. It's if it's going to work with the UX version, but when it gets to around 100 megabytes after a minute, it should uh, try to um, clear the memory, uh, extra memory being used that's not needed by Firefox. Okay, after a brief pause, it did. It brought it back down. It will go back up. But uh, that's sort of a, a loose proof of concept, I guess, as you would call it. Okay. So you keep an eye on uh, the resource monitor. And you can see the standby memory, uh, which is great. Like, we want to see this being used more. You can see it. You might be able to see it uh, moving up and down inside the graph here. So that's just a quick look at uh, clean mem and why I use it and... Basically, any program you run that has a memory leak, it should keep it intact by default. Like, you don't have to set up a special uh, parameter for it. It should uh, just keep it uh, low. And there, go. Firefox has gone back down again. So, it's uh, that's basically the purpose on uh, larger memory systems. And uh, for a lower memory system, you might it, it should help out quite a bit. Okay, and uh, I think that's it for this one. So it's clean mem on PC WinTech, and uh, give it a try. It's free, and that's it for this one. Thanks so much for watching. We'll talk to you soon, and bye for now.